everybody, this is Kathy, and it's nice to have you here. Today I'm going to be printing on some fabric and then doing a little sewing and making a tag or a card, I'm not sure yet. Um, I've put printed fabric, printed an image on one piece of fabric just to see how it would turn out and it turned out pretty well. I'm using, pretty good. I'm using fabric shapes that I got at Joann's. They're five by five and they're 100% cotton. You can get those in the quilting section. And then I downloaded some images from Etsy. So I'm going to use these tag images. And what I've done is I've run them through my printer and these were giant tags, so I made it so it would be put print two on the same piece of paper. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to choose which, which picture I like best. And I think I'm going to go with the one with the two girls. Then I'm going to take some tape runner and I'm simply going to put tape runner on the top. And I'm going to take my piece of fabric and I'm going to put it right across the top as well. Just like that. Now I'm also going to put some here just to hold down the fabric. The reason I print first is so I know the placement of where to put the fabric when I run it through my when I um, run it through my printer to get the image on the fabric. So I will be right back. I'm going to run through this through my printer. And when I put it in my printer, I'm going to turn it upside down so that when it comes out, it comes out like this and prints on this side. Okay, I'll be right back. Okay, let's see how it came out. So this is how it came out of my printer, and this is the fabric cloth on top. And it printed pretty well. I think what happened is this folded over during the printing. So I'm going to do it one more time, and I'm going to put a little bit more tape down because I really wanted the image of the bird. Particularly up here. Okay, I will be right back. Okie doke. Let's see if the second time is a charm. Let's pull this up. And sure enough, the second time is a charm. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut around the edge. One thing you wanna make sure is when you run it through your printer, if you have to do it a second time, make sure you're still pressing the controls in the printer that allow you to print two images per page. Otherwise you'll get a giant image, which might be okay with what you're making. And I'm going to cut off the pinking sheared edges. Okay. And I have something that looks like that. What I'm going to do next is I'm going to take this 
I'm going to dab some glue down just a little bit just to keep it in place. I'll pull that down just a bit because I want the image of the hole to be where the hole actually is on the tag. Or at least as close to that. Well, I guess it doesn't matter, actually. So I'm gonna put it down here. Next, I'm going to run my sewing machine around the edges. I'll be right back. Okay, I finished that. I'm going to cut around the edges. The tension in my sewing machine needs to be adjusted, I see. but that is okay. Next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to take a larger tag and first I'm going to punch a hole in this. Now, next thing I want to do is add some background to this and I think I have some paper that I can use, kind of like this. Hmm, let's see. Nah. Let me see if I can make use of the other tags that were on the paper. Perhaps make a collage of the images.
Maybe we get some book page. We can have some. Okay. Actually, Need a little piece over here. I think this would be perfect. Add a little lace.
Okay, and I'm gonna make this so you can, it can also be a little tuck spot. And let's trim this up. top of this one. Okay, now I may as well make this part of my tagged full deck challenge. By tucking a card in there and Let's see what I've got. I have this piece, which might be nice. Just glue this one on.
Mm -hmm. I have some of the scraps left. So we'll have part paper and part fabric. I need another little bit to cover this. It's like a puzzle piece. To lift this around the edges. Okay, I'm going to add some eyelets to this. And a little bit of lace. Next, next, hmm. didn't work.
Okay. Alrighty. So we have this, and this can slip in here. And there you have it. So we printed on fabric and we added a card. So now we have a tag number 24 in our tagged full deck challenge. Thanks for joining me, and you all have a great day. Bye.